Octopuses are animals that change color, smell with their arms, eat with their arms, build nests, solve problems, play games, and make love. Octopuses are the most intelligent invertebrates. Let's take a closer look at this intelligent animal that is even older than dinosaurs. Octopuses come from the Octopodidae family. Octopus or octopod is formed from the Latin words octo meaning eight and podia meaning foot. The Latin word octopus literally means eight-legged. Octopuses are cephalopods with a round body, bulging eyes resembling human eyes, and eight arms. Cephalopods, a class of invertebrates, have a good nervous system. They live in all oceans. There are 300 described species. Most octopus species hunt on the seafloor and in dark waters. They like to eat crabs, shrimps, and lobsters the most. They can even attack sharks if they are hungry. Octopuses usually attack their prey from above and bring it to their mouths with their arms. They stick their arms into openings in the seabed in search of food. But seals, whales, and large fish also hunt them for food. The ability to change color is unique in very few animals. Octopuses do it very well. Octopuses change their color as a hunting strategy, for protection from predators, and to communicate with other octopuses. They usually want to change to the color that is closest to the color of their environment. Most often they change to white, red, gray, brown, pink, blue, and green. They do this thanks to colored cells called chromatophores. Octopuses have such a well-developed defense mechanism that they can make themselves look like a coral or a rock. They make this possible by changing their skin texture with specialized cells called papillae. When threatened, for example, they release an inky liquid that clouds the water. This confuses the attacker, and they try to escape. The arms of octopuses are also very interesting. They can tear off their own arms if necessary in case of danger, and then they grow new ones. They grow a new arm in a few weeks. The researchers found that the severed arms move and try to hunt as if they hadn't been severed. The advanced nervous system in octopuses' arms can sometimes make decisions independently of the brain. So it's safe to say that octopuses can think with their arms. They can also taste and smell thanks to the thousands of suction cups on their arms. About two-thirds of their neurons are located in their arms. Their neurons are estimated to be 500 million in total. Yet their brains are larger in proportion to their bodies than any other animal except birds and mammals. The blood of octopuses is blue, not red. We have red blood thanks to the iron pigment called hemoglobin. Octopuses have a copper pigment called hemocyanin. These pigments in the blood give the blood its color. Octopuses have three hearts. Therefore, they need more oxygen than normal. The copper atoms in hemocyanin also have the ability to bind with a large number of oxygen atoms. Thanks to this substance, they meet the oxygen needs of their bodies. Even if it can't find enough oxygen, it doesn't have any problems because it stores this need in its blood. Some octopuses have venom glands. They usually use it for defensive purposes. The species known as the blue-ringed octopus is very poisonous. It is strong enough to easily kill even a human. Octopuses with such powerful features are actually colorblind. They cannot see the surrounding colors correctly. So how can they camouflage? Yes, arms again. The light-sensitive chromophore cells under their skin provide this. They have super photoreceptor genes. In other words, they can see with their arms, smell with their arms, and think with their arms. Octopuses are solitary animals. Octopuses are also excellent at reproduction. However, female octopus fry dies before they hatch. The male octopus dies shortly after mating due to cell aging. The female octopus lays more than 50,000 eggs at a time. The eggs hatch in about 40 days. During this process, it protects the eggs from predators and aerates them with a constant stream of water. But during this protection, they are fed less. 
the body of the female octopus begins to undergo biological changes. The animal harms itself. According to some studies, they can eat their arm when needed. They live an average of six months to two years. Octopuses have an average length of between 3 centimeters and 10 meters. Octopuses are so intelligent that they build their own nests. They also put a door on it for security. Some have even been seen decorating the nest. Now look carefully at the screen. Yes, these creatures can also use tools. Octopuses can also understand physics. They also like to play games. They can understand a maze and easily open a jar lid. Octopuses can also solve problems. But nervous systems are quite complex for scientists. Invertebrates make up 95% of living things. Octopuses are invertebrate mollusks, a class of cephalopods. Cephalopods have been on Earth for about 500 million years. Octopuses, on the other hand, broke out of their shells about 140 million years ago and resembled their present form. Scientists have found the fossil of a 330-million-year-old octopus ancestor in Montana. This fossil has been identified as the ancestor of both octopuses and vampire squids. Octopuses existed before dinosaurs. Humans are more closely related to dinosaurs than octopuses. These incredible creatures attract a lot of attention because of their appearance. Some people describe them as ocean aliens. Thank you.